Is it Thursday already? Oh, yeah. Is it Thursday? Okay. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Every now and then, you just got to take a day for yourself. People will call you lazy. People will call you stuff. But I'm like, we've been on nine-hour days for probably a year now. They're working us every Saturday they can get away with. And finally get to draw a line and say, and say, that's it, I'm done. That's enough. You know, you, you know, it's just... And plus, like I said, I got my personal days back a few days ago. And I'm like... You wake up one morning, you realize, wow, I didn't really get that much sleep. I woke up like 45 minutes for the alarm clock and... You just say, screw it, I'm taking a day off. Yeah, I, I saw that too. The, um, I was coming to that. Um, I can't take credit for that. Somebody said I was right again. No, I I went off what Doctor Who filming location said. You know, they, they're the ones who spotted it. Apparently also there's photos coming up now. More photos with Shudi Gatwa, but from what I'm hearing, Millie Gibson isn't appearing in any. Now this could be due to a... Um, you know, they're trying to keep her costume secret. I don't know. I know Shooty asked the people there to keep his current costume. He's wearing a secret. Okay. And I know they, they them guys don't want to accept that fact, Mark, that basically that whole idea came from Chris Chibnall. Oh, and by the way... That you see, they never want to give credit where credit's due. That it was all planned by the master RTD, and they want to justify it, like when um, when I said it was Sidney Newman who first came up with the idea of putting a female doctor in. Well, he didn't want Daleks in the show either, and I'm like, he created the show. They can't trump that argument, and. Um, but look very closely at that photo that was released with the announcement and they slipped up again. Look in the background of that photo of uh, Bonnie Langford that was put out yesterday. Anybody catch it? Because some other folks have. It's the helipad set that we that was shown on Google Earth a few months ago. So they pretty much, it's that unit, you know, the big unit symbol in it. So right there, bom, 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 bang, 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 bang. Yeah, yeah, Mark called it. Yeah, you see, it, it, it is, it's that big, hel it's that big pad. That launching pad, helipad, whatever it is. <laughs> Exactly. So, and I love all the jokes that are being made and all that. Well, she'll probably just appear at the end. No, she's not going to appear at the end of the season. She was on the set for Series 14. They don't drag you out to a set location for just a bit appearance, okay? Then again, if it was interior filming, maybe. But, um... Yeah, Big Finish tried a unit spin off a while back, and now they're doing this one that's currently with the modern characters. But if you look it up, they tried doing one back in the past, and it didn't last all that long. Um, yeah, I have an eerie feeling there's going to be a lot more people in the 60th than we anticipate, anticipated. I mean, um, I know Sylvester's been a bit naughty at cons lately, and... Well, I wanted to thank Saeed, by the way, I believe it was, who sent me a birthday card. I've been meaning to mention it, and dummy me, uh, it did arrive, I did get it, and I want to thank you very much. Um, I just kept forgetting to mention it, because my brain's on overload lately with all the info that's being you know, siphoned out. I 
I know somebody tried to put out a false rumor that Sarah Sutton was seen on set. And like I said, you got to watch out for those. Yep, Colin Baker. His birthday today. Thank you for reminding me. I saw the announcement on Twitter. Uh, somebody had already beat me to it. And... I agree with you, yeah, because we heard that stuff on set when they were filming that Mel Bush got mentioned. And originally I was a bit skittish because I was like, could be any Mel, but then again. But now that we've seen more and more of Bonnie Langford. Oh. So I love it out here. Well, it's about 48 degrees according to the car. Not too hot, not too cold. Well, I don't get too excited about that kind of thing because we've had a lot of blurry stuff show up. And also, it's like, why was the photo so blurred? What'd you do? Go, er, 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 your phone? It's, that's why I'm always very skeptical. It's 48 degrees Fahrenheit. Oh, uh, there we go. So a bit chilly, but not too bad. Watch them folks meander in. They're like, what's he up to? Uh, so yeah, we... Nice to see, you know, Bonnie Langford out there. Yeah, shooty a new outfit. Like I said, we, he asked everybody to keep cool on that, and I can honor that. I'm sure somebody will probably leak it out, so they go, hee, hee, hee. So. <laughs> and I die laughing when they go, you know you're just upsetting the showrunner when you do this kind of stuff, and I'm like, this is RTD we're talking about. You know how much stuff he leaks out? Yeah, we've seen, yeah, Shooty now in a number of different outfits, so. I really wish they had, you know, rotated 13s more often. Other than getting a different colored shirt. Like I said, like the outfit for Spy of Fall was nice, and. I know, that was ridiculous. And that was probably, I don't know if that was his decision or the BBC made that call because about you know, John Sim and that trailer. And it's like, what were they thinking? You know, they killed one of the nicest surprise twists they ever had. And I love how there's people go, oh, I knew it was him all along. I was that. And I, no, you didn't because nobody knew who that character was. He was in makeup before he left his trailer and until he went back into it. And then he didn't leave till well after everybody else was gone. Nobody had no idea who that character was with Bill Potts. Yeah, you're right. Capaldi did too. Yeah, he changed outfits ever so often, yeah. Yeah, but I mean, during the filming... It would have been a nice surprise, you know, for those folks, you know, when he popped up on the uh, actual episode rather than, you know, bickety bickety bam.
then you're getting to the final two episodes of the show and it's like well that's got to be him you know it's like sorry i'm just trying to remember back to the hartnell era because well i haven't watched a whole lot of hartnell recently i hate to admit it but Oh, I gotta get caught up on Hart and Old Trout and all that. I haven't really revisited those years in a little while. Same thing with Pertwee. It's been too long. Oh yeah, Sasha Dewan was really good. Yeah, every just about everybody got caught to guard on that. But actually, sadly, I already knew. I had a source tell me that Sasha Dewan was the master. When I saw him pop up the episode, I'm like, okay, I see where this is going. It was my fault. Oh, oh. I love how everybody tries to hype on that, you know, harp on that episode, and it was a lame reveal. Blah, blah, yeah, yeah, it was a lame reveal because they didn't know. They got caught off guard. Sadly, no, I don't have any... Like I said, um, ever since everything went over to Bad Wolf, haven't been able to... You know, none of my sources have been really able to get their hands on anything. Because they're still over at Rothlock. Yeah, now that all the production's moved over, I'm pretty much relying on what I can get from set. I don't, I don't believe in... Gallifrey based forums anymore. I, I like I said I have a membership there, but I've used it less time than I have fingers on my hand across the last decade. Because the people who did know what they were talking about over there are long gone. Um also 4chan and Reddit, that's mostly bogus information getting put out there. Okay, there we go. Wow, it's actually letting me moderate the chat today. I'm shocked. <laughs> and I'm still ticked at Facebook because whenever I try to, in my Dr. Freedom profile, go to the Dr. Freedom page, the top part of the page loads and none of the posts loads. So if I want to read the posts, I have to go through their meta thing or I have to follow the notifications. And if I want to physically share something, I have to go through their meta blah, 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 crap. And I have messaged them constantly saying, uh, I'd like this fixed. It's on, going on almost a week now. Um... I know it was, you know, we kind of, you know, knew they were going to confirm it because I don't think they planned on anybody seeing her because they tried to slip her in and out the back of the thing and it failed miserably, especially when you got somebody going over the radio saying, has Bonnie left yet? You know. It's like, come on, it's not hard to spot Bonnie Langford. You know, her her hair color like stands out 50 pages. You know, 50 feet away. It's like, yep, that's Bonnie Langford. She's a ginger. You can... <laughs> Well, folks, it is that time again. I have got to get inside, so please take care of yourselves and each other out there. 
Be kind, be calm, be safe. And we'll see you all on the flip side. Enjoy your Thursdays.